Premiering in Morocco, Visa for Music is a new fair aimed at promoting music from Africa and the Middle East. Some 60 exhibitors took part in this first edition in the city of Rabat. It was a chance for agents, festival directors and record companies to discover new talents or established artists like Moroccan musician Aziz Samawi, who presented his new album on opening night. The founder of the event is Brahim El Mazned, who's been organizing the Timitar Music Festival in Agadir for over a decade. What people often forget is that there are one billion people in Africa and there's a thriving artistic life. It's a continent with a very rich musical culture. And I believe there are ways of developing an interesting platform here in Africa without needing to go through Europe or the United States to get our own artists recognized. Alice Tones is a brass band from Benin who came to the music fair to try to develop international contacts. Though they're starting to make a name for themselves, they cannot live from their music and there is little public help to support musicians. Every year we get invited to perform at festivals around the world, but we have to pay for our own transport. You need funding for that, so you send out requests, but you don't get any positive answers, and you end up going around in circles. That's our biggest challenge. Nordestand is a band from Casablanca that mixes Afro-rap, electro and rock. They've already achieved considerable success in their home country with their energetic sound and committed lyrics about life in a globalized world. They're now hoping to seduce audiences further afield. In addition to the conferences organized at the fair, there were also speed dating sessions where musicians and agents could meet and hopefully do business. And we're very happy to be in Visa for Music. We think it's like incredible to have an arts marketplace here in North Africa. It is done and uh, organized in a very a proper way that you have a chance to meet everyone in the meetings and the concert showcases or speed meetings uh, like now. In the world music scene, I would say that we get uh, quite many offers, but still there are a lot of work to do. And I think uh, the way is maybe to do uh, to organize such meetings like here, like this music fair. I think it's a very good idea. I know that the network that is connected to this event, Visa for Music have very, very good connections in, in the Middle East and also uh, all over Africa. So it's a, it's a very good place to be. For me, I would say, of course, to network, but mainly to see the, the showcases. Mashru Leila is a Lebanese alternative rock band from Beirut. With its eclectic sound, an openly gay frontman and politically charged lyrics, the band makes no secret of its ambition to challenge the conventions of Arabic pop culture. The fair was a chance for its members to address an international audience of decision makers on the music scene. Geographically, Morocco is certainly the right place to hold a music fair and offer musicians from the region a new international platform. One can but wish Visa for Music a bright future. Wolfgang Spindler aus Rabat, Marokko for Euronews.